Hi family, it's me, Miss Sam. How are you? Hugs and kisses to ya. So, Lisa Marie Presley. I wonder what her spirit thinks of Michael Lockwood winning custody, full custody of those girls. Okay, the twins, Finlay and Harper. What on earth does Lisa Marie Presley think? I know I'm already going to do two readings on this, but um, <clears throat> let's get some initial energies, okay? So I think Lisa likes rose scents. She likes rose or roses. So I'm just going to use some of this alcohol-based stuff with a hint of rose to it, okay? I'm not going too hard. <laughs> See if I can draw her energy a little bit to find out what she feels, how she, not even how she thinks because she's a spirit, how her spirit reacts to this news. Lisa Marie Presley fought her ex-husband, Michael Lockwood, father of the twins, in court because she did not want to share custody with him. She didn't want him to have full custody or shared custody at all. Um, she also accused him of having inappropriate images on his devices, etc. Okay? So she felt that he was unsuitable to parent. Let's see what she feels about this. How do you feel, Lisa Marie Presley? How do you feel? Take time, be gentle, be gentle, be gentle, be gentle. Page of Wands. Didn't this come up? Do you remember I did a reading in Egypt where I couldn't get any good lighting, so I laid down on the floor of the patio of the balcony. Did this card come up before the Page of Wands here? Because this card's got some sexual stuff on it as well. <clears throat> See the pineapples there, held in both hands. Two pineapples. Oh, might have to cut this reading short. I asked her to go easy. I asked her to go easy. You, you hear me ask her to go easy, card. Seven of Swords. Uh, the, ish, the initial energy came up she said he's lying about something. But the thing about this card is that there are several houses or several places, several locations, several huts. Okay, this, this um, wolf that you can see here with um, swords, daggers in his mouth. The swords here in this reading refers to decisions. <clears throat> so does Michael Lockwood have several homes, several houses for different things, different activities? I don't know. I'm just going with the energy. This reading is bullshit, okay? It's all bullshit. It's for entertainment purposes only, okay? None of this is real. But this card is telling me, Lisa's given me this card and this card that has come some... And she's saying something that he's lying about something and that there are several houses or several places. What that has got to do with her daughters, I don't know. And do I even want to know? Card. Oh, sometimes when you open up a portal, family. Ay. Sometimes when you open up a portal, it's not so easy to close it. You have to go through formalities to close it. And there is a certain pace that I honor. 
because I have to, but this is being severely disrupted in this reading. Like, I want to just stop the reading here, but I can't. I've opened up this portal, so I have to take my time and close it gently. Also, I'm working with this lady's spirit, and it's, her spirit is, is, I say, ferocious. Is there such a word as ferocious or ferocious? One of them two. Y'all are wordsmiths. You'll work it out. The, the spiritual king of coins here in reverse. She's saying he ain't got money and he needs it. Two of swords here. Some woman. We're going to help him. Hold on a second. And then death here in reverse. Uh, uh, okay, here we got the king of coins here in reverse. Lisa's saying he ain't going to get her money. That's basically what she's saying. Because the first energy was he ain't got no money. It has progressed to he ain't going to get her money. That's what she's saying. She's saying no, he's not going to get it. And we've got this death card in reverse, which is slightly alarming. Again, this is all bullshit. Disclaimer, entertainment purposes only. Two of swords. Sorry for the swearing. Excuse me. And this is some woman here with the two of swords here. And she is between the money or not and the possible outcome here. And he's on stage I'm just telling you the psychic energy. This is a death card reverse. You can see there's like a, it's a stage. So it would be a performance and it would be for many people to see. You know, there's that Bible verse. With mine eyes, I shall see the reward of the wicked. This is what has come up. I mean, it's come up in readings before, but it's the first time it's come up in a Lisa Marie Presley reading. Presley drama reading. She didn't even talk about her mum like this, and she was hardcore. Did you see the reading that, that was conducted a couple of weeks ago that I conducted here on this channel, where she said, leave my daughter alone? Did you see that one? And it came out that... But you see, Priscilla is made for that type of thing. She's hard. Remember, I, I, tapped, I tapped the tarot deck. Remember, I said... Priscilla is hardcore. She's a hard nut. So she don't care if the ghost of Lisa Marie Presley chases her around her mansion. But she don't care. She don't. She's going straight for the money. Even if she has to go right through Riley and right through her. But uh, you can see here. But it's very worrying. I, I, well, it's not my place to worry, but... Uh, why is, is Lisa talking about several houses, several places or something? Now, as a musician, sometimes musicians have studios that they rent out or that they have in a separate house or even in their own home, like they used to have it back in the day, you know. They used to have their studios in a basement or something. But he, I don't know, there's several properties or several locations showing up, and Lisa is talking about them. She's saying he's not going to get her money. So if that's his intention... Lisa's spirit, her ghost, her duppy, whatever you want to say, her energy is saying you ain't getting it. And I don't know who this is here with the two of swords because it seems there's a strange energy on it. It could be Willy Wonka's wife. <laughs> it could be Michael Lockwood's wife. And it looked like, you know, see, she, her head is covered and everything there and she's underneath the crescent moon and She's got two swords in her hand, which means that she's thinking about things deeply, her decision, because after all, she is the man's wife. But what on earth would she be thinking about deeply? From a spiritual point of view, I don't blame her for thinking very deeply about this. But he's gone ahead and he's got full custody. So now he is firmly and squarely part of this battle with to do with the, the insurance policy and the... Um, man, the trust, the amendment to the trust, and everything else that Lisa Marie Presley left to those girls, now that he has full custody of them.
You see, Priscilla is very, very active. So why didn't she file for full custody of the children? Unless, of course, she didn't want to because it's come out in readings that she only really likes one of those girls. So it's not like Priscilla could go to the judge or fill out paperwork and say, I want this twin. I don't want the other one. <laughs> no doubt if she could do it legally, I'm sure she would. Disclaimer. I don't think she, I don't think Priscilla would bat an eyelid at doing that kind of thing, but legally it probably wouldn't work. <laughs> the judge would probably be like, is it LA, is it LA County? <laughs> family court or something like that they'll be like <laughs> you know stranger things have happened anywho i'm looking again at this death card here in reverse and i, I quoted the scripture only with my eyes shall isn't it psalms 91 only with my eyes shall i look and behold and see the reward of the wicked it's it's like lisa wants to see him disgraced <sighs> I don't know what kind of spiritual stuff, may, well, actually I do, I do. I was just going to say to you, I don't know what kind of spiritual stuff people are wrapped up into, but I do, I do. I'm very well aware. Uh, but, you know, you would think that there would be some kind of, maybe there is a spiritual response to this, but Lisa's energy is so very, very strong. I don't know how many rings of fire somebody would have to jump through and what kind of sacrifice or offering one would have to give to quell Lisa's fire, her spirit, which is super, 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 super duper active. A ferocious, ferocious. Like she's a fire, she just wanna consume him. She just won't burn his ass up, so to speak, you know, spiritually. But uh, we have the, the manifestation of this is a stage, and she wants him to be disgraced on stage. His saving grace is this person here. I don't know if it's his wife or whoever, but this is somebody here. I don't know if this is one of the twins or his wife, but there's a somebody, and she's thinking about the spiritual because he clearly isn't. His ex-wife is now deceased. She was fighting him tooth and nail, tooth and nail, she was fighting him tooth and nail for custody of, so that he would not have access to them girls. She went as far as filing police reports. Ooh, ooh. <laughs> File them. To say, look, this guy is a predator, and he's this, and he's that, and he's X, and he's Y, and he's Z. Man, when things go bad, they really go bad, don't they? Because one time she was really in love with the dude. You remember? One time. Him and his long guitar. She really was into him. She married one Michael and divorced him. Then she married him. Both Michaels were users. I think I better leave this reading right here. But anyway, just to remind you of the cards, darlings. This camera, yeah. There's smoke, there's fire. 